The available Smart Cruise Control System from Genesis helps to increase the safety of your trip as well as making it less tiring. The system allows you to program the vehicle to help maintain the desired speed as well as the minimum safe distance between yourself and the vehicle ahead. You can turn Smart Cruise Control on or off by pressing the Cruise switch on the steering wheel. The Set Minus button is used to set the desired cruise control speed as well as reduce it. The Resume Plus button is used to resume cruise control or to increase the vehicle speed. The Cancel button cancels cruise control operation. To set the Smart Cruise Control speed, the vehicle must be traveling between 5 and 120 miles per hour if there is no vehicle in front of you, or traveling between 0 and 120 miles per hour if there is a vehicle traveling in front of you. Simply accelerate to the desired speed, then press the Set Minus button. The set speed and vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle distance in the LCD display will illuminate. Now you can release the accelerator pedal and the desired speed will be automatically maintained. To increase or decrease speed in one mile per hour increments, tap the plus or minus button briefly, once for each mile per hour increment. To increase or decrease speeds in five mile per hour increments, press and hold the plus or minus button and the speeds will change in five mile per hour increments. It's good to know that if there is a vehicle in front of you and your vehicle speed is between 5 and 20 miles per hour when you set your speed, the vehicle speed will automatically set to 20 miles per hour. Once Smart Cruise Control is turned on, you can set the desired minimum distance to the vehicle in front of you. To adjust the vehicle distance, press the Vehicle to Vehicle Distance button. Each time the button is pressed, the vehicle to vehicle distance changes. 4 is the longest, while 1 is the shortest. Pressing the button after reaching 1 will change it back to 4. The system will remember the last distance you used every time you turn the system on or off, and every time you restart the vehicle. You can also adjust the sensitivity with which the Smart Cruise Control system will maintain the set distance. On some models, use the LCD display screen to go to User Settings, select Driver Assistance, then SCC Reaction. On other models, you will use the navigation system to access it. Press Setup, then select Vehicle, then Driver Assistance, then SCC Reaction. Here, you have three choices. Fast means the vehicle will react sooner than normal to maintain the set distance. Normal means that the vehicle will react at a normal speed to maintain the set distance. Slow means that the vehicle will react later than normal to maintain the set distance. The system will remember the last sensitivity setting selected every time you turn the system on or off and every time you restart the vehicle. With Smart Cruise Control, if the vehicle ahead of you should stop, your vehicle will also come to a full stop. If the vehicle ahead of you starts moving, your vehicle will start as well. However, if you are stopped for more than three seconds, you must depress the accelerator pedal or push up on the Resume Plus switch or push down the Set Minus switch to start driving again. On some models, you can also use the conventional cruise control. This will maintain only the speed of the vehicle. Consult your owner's manual to determine if your vehicle has this feature. To use it, turn the cruise control system on then press and hold the Vehicle to Vehicle Distance button for more than two seconds. In the LCD display, you will see the words Cruise Control displayed. The system will now maintain only the speed of your vehicle. You must manually adjust the distance to other vehicles by depressing the brake pedal. The system does not automatically adjust the distance to vehicles in front of you. You can re-engage Smart Cruise Control by pressing and holding the Vehicle to Vehicle Distance button for more than two seconds again. In addition, when you turn the cruise control system off and back on by either pressing the cruise button or by turning the engine off and back on, the smart cruise control feature will again be the default setting. Smart cruise control may not fully function in bad road conditions or in certain weather conditions. For a full list of circumstances in which the systems may not be active, as well as more features of the system, see your owner's manual. While Smart Cruise Control may provide assistance, it is not in control of your vehicle. You are. Always keep in mind that safe driving is your responsibility.